Good, Tom. Let's talk about the headlock for a little bit. All right. So what's happening? Let me follow Peter real quick. So we know the attack. Um, so in this case, uh, maybe I'm using, maybe I'm attacking this throat. Okay. Maybe I'm pulling it somewhere. Okay. Maybe I'm all the way deep under and I'm, I'm attacking his carotid artery. Okay. Um, so the first thing you're doing is what? what, 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 what what's the immediate danger here? I'm protecting, protect your neck. Okay, cool. So how do you protect your neck? Turn to the side. Okay, but he can't. He can't turn to the side. So what, what's he doing? Drop your weight, drop your weight. He still won't be able to turn to the side. He can't touch his chin. So, so what's that? Pluck. Pluck. So because he can't do any of the things y'all just said. All right? He can't turn his neck because I'm in. He can't get his chin down because it's up under. Make sense? He, uh, he can drop his weight, but that's not gonna fix those other two problems. So he has to reach up explosively and pluck, and that gives him space. Space equals escape, okay? So that's the first thing he's doing. Now that he's plucked, he can, so, no, 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 calm yourself. <laughs> now he can do some of those things you talked about. Somebody said turn the chin, can you turn the chin? Okay, cool. Somebody said drop your weight, okay? You're okay, turn your head, okay, cool. All right? He can do some of those things now because he has a good plug. So just starting off from that, you're going to come in, all right? And he comes in now. Once this is in, okay? Okay, let me talk about something real quick, all right? Yes, you want to turn your head right away. What's the chances of you being able to do it? Okay? If, some, if you don't know somebody behind you, look, he knows them behind, he knows them behind them, he can't get it in. Make sense? So that so you probably wanted to go with your pluck. Make sense? So assuming you, you got here, now he's gonna pluck, boom, and he's gonna fix those other things. He's gonna turn his head and drop his weight. Make sense? So let's just work on that part. Just as you repeat it, we're gonna be able to move on. You gotta get this hand down and get you some space to hide your chin, tuck your chin, drop your weight. Make sense? Raise your shoulder, all those good things. Alright? Just do that, give me a switch. We don't we get to get through this fast, we don't want to go to another something else. So pull up, drop your weight. Pull up, turn your chain. Good, time. So now we're gonna make that turn even more explosive, right? So he's behind me. Right? Now, the uh, I want to protect my neck. I'm protecting my neck from what? His arm. His arm. So pretend like this arm is a sword. It's against my neck. What way don't I want to go? This way. Okay. So if you're leaning forward, you're cutting your own neck off. Okay. You gotta go that way. Alright? So I got a good pluck. Boom. I've turned my head. Alright? I need to go that way. So I'm gonna use my head to try to push his chest back and look at the bottom of my foot. Those are just um, things I, I remember so I can make space here. I want to make the space. Don't move, Peter. Look what I'm doing to his arm. His arm, his elbow came away from his body. Make sense? I made a doorway. The door was closed and I opened it. I opened it with my head, my shoulder, and my movement. Make sense? That's what I want you to do. Oh, and my shoulder too. I want to. I want you to open the door. Don't even go through the door. Just open the door. Make sense? Mm -hmm. Whatever knowledge you can think of your head to make that make sense. <laughs> go ahead. <laughs> I just gave you my three. Okay. Good. Nice. Good. Time. So now, David. So you feel yourself opening the door. Boom. Look at that. This is the door. All right, I'm opening the door. Okay, now I'm gonna walk right through the door. Make sense? All right. Of course, I'm gonna put my head through. My head's up right now, so I'm talking. But in order to walk, what do I need to do with my feet? I'm gonna gotta move them. Okay. And I want to go that way. So I'm gonna take my feet and step through. Make sense? All right. I'm not. 
doing that. Opening the door, okay? I'm rolling up under, like Lou says, like my head's, head's a, uh, um, like his, uh, my head is a deodorant. <laughs> and I'm putting deodorant on his underarm. <laughs> I'm stepping through and I'm out. Make sense? Get out. Thanks, baby. So, boom. I'm almost out, right? I'm pretty much really, I'm out of the choke. Nothing is touching my neck right now. Couple of strike options, right? Closest weapon, closest target. So that's good. Closest weapon, closest target. Closest weapon, closest target. I'm not going to hit him in the inside of the style, hit him in the wrong. Okay. Boom, boom. Make sense? Now, uh oh, closest weapon, closest target. I can go for without. Okay. Mouth of hand strike, ridge of hand strike, mouth of hand, thumb knuckle, ridge of hand, all the same strike. Okay. So boom, I'm down, almost out, bop, I just strike to the groan. I'm here, okay? Closest weapon, closest target. What's the, what's the closest weapon that I have to a target? Ridge right hand. Huh? Ridge right hand to the groan, right? Left hand to the groan? Yeah. What, where, look, 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 look. It's right there. <laughs> it's right there. You know, and if I step on his foot, what would he might do? He moved back. He moved back and gave me what? Space. Space. Make sense? Mm -hmm. Add the foot stops. Add the strike. Don't add the stops on their foot, but give them a seat simulation. Make sense? Mm -hmm. The foot. Good time. Nice. 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 All right, cool. Everybody, take a knee. Slide back a little bit. Okay, let's talk about another uh, attack. Body. Yeah. yeah. Very common attack, especially nowadays. All right. And instead of them doing this, which is common. to learn the mechanics of the escape, but you're gonna come up to your partner 
you're going to, you can punch them in the stomach. I don't know how you're going to get them down there. All right? You're going to go around. Armpit is pretty much going to be on the back of their neck almost. You're looping around. I have long arms. You can see my arm come through. All right? um, people can do it even with their thumb. We'll get into that later. You're going to grab your wrist the same exact kind of way. Get to nice little squat stance. All right? They're going to reach and pluck from there. Make sense? Go. Boom. Nice. And then I'll be set. I'll go in again. Nice. Three times and switch. I come around and back. Let's go. Okay. Yeah.